Overlooked, undervalued, misunderstood, mercilessly joked about. Accordions are making a comeback. Shortly after they were invented, these things were in Louisiana. Czech or Slovak or Polish or Slovenian or Italian. It was considered part of their culture, you know, up until the 60s. It went out of style. It didn't mean people stopped using it because, you know, you turned on the radio, you still heard it. You went to the movies, you heard it in the backgrounds. We have a division between serious art and low art. And the accordion, in our country anyway, is usually put into the low art category, which is something that I like about it. And the condemned man in his tough seat. It's a great sort of mix of, of nostalgia, but also some subversion, a little bit of um, sort of cabaret debauchery. And I'm a lucky girl. I've got it all. Yeah, I, I can't really describe the audience per se, but it's certainly people that appreciate sort of um, misfits. The accordion is hip, the accordion is square. Try and make it too respectable, it comes and you know, bites you in the butt. If you get too down with it, it reveals its elegance. It's a computer. Now this piece is straight out of a postmodern minimalist uh, aesthetic. There's no Slovenian American language at all in this. But then as I started collaborating with dancers and theater companies, I said, oh, well, I could use some of these dance forms that I grew up with. And I discovered fun again. It's time to take a fresh look at the accordion and all the players who are making it popular again. <laughs> <laughs>